this trend that has emerged, especially if you were to say I move away from the two months, you know, let me move to the end of uh, end of August. I think we saw that big collapse. But after, in spite of that, investors did not panic. We saw inflows increasing. We saw five times more flow coming on the day when the markets crashed. I think this is clearly a sign of the maturity of the retail investors. I think, and you're right. I think what's happening is that we all know Indians love for gold and real estate. Last three years, we have not seen any returns coming in. I think with the markets maturing, the confidence in the uh, in the country, and also a lot of good work that the media and the industry is doing at trying to educate investors. I think investors have started ignoring the short-term volatility and still looking at the long-term returns. Can you throw in some numbers because you know numbers go down very well with our viewers. So uh, let me, you know, so I think uh, the f- uh, four A's before this government was there, mutual fund industry saw an outflow of twenty thousand crores. In one year after this government has come, we have seen an inflow of more than one lakh crores. I think that's the kind of number. Then again, I think uh, when we look at the retail numbers, the individual investors for the last five years we were seeing every month there used to be a negative number. Uh, in the last six months, we are seeing every month incremental. There are more than two to three lakh new investors who are coming into the industry. Uh, the day the market uh, collapsed, average day in a, uh, any average day we see a gross sales. Of equity about 300 crores. That's uh, only for your. Uh, no, I'm talking the industry level. Industry level. I think the day the markets collapsed, you know, that day we saw about 1,000 to 1,200 crores. So I mean, that's the that, that proactive. Right. So I think investors are proactive and becoming savvy, and I think they are not. And another uh, another important thing I like to highlight, I think if I was to go back, you know, for a few years back, whenever markets crashed crashed like this, we saw investors panic, calls coming to us, people calling us, distributors calling us. This time there was nothing like that. I think we are very happy. So the natural cycle is supportive. Natural cycle is supportive. But, but, but have you got lucky because gold has come down and real estate is not going anywhere. I alternates think, are not doing well. That's why or equities I, are. Doing I think well. it's not a question of alternates. I think if for an asset allocation point of view, you need to always be investing in all. But I think the what's coming out, the investors are becoming more sensible that you cannot be investments cannot be lopsided. You cannot ignore equities. I think that's the clear theme which is coming out. So let me take this example of our own Reliance Growth Fund. I think over a 20-year period. I mean, we analyzed. I think markets have fallen more than five times, more than 35 times, more than five percent, 35 times. Now, in spite of that, all that volatility, the 10 rupee NAV is 80 rupees. Person who invested one lakh rupees, 80 lakh rupees. I think that's the kind of return investors have made. And today, I think we are, another interesting trend, Nikunj, that we are seeing is we, retail investors have started coming in through SIPs. So uh, in the industry, yeah. what we saw in Korea as in 90s is happening. Oh, yeah, sir. So uh, at an industry level, we have about 80 lakh SIPs now. Which means every month uh, domestic flows, which means 80 lakh SIPs into three, about three and a half, three thousand crores. So three, SIPs are not getting cancelled in this fall. No, That is they the are getting point. added. Okay. So three thousand crores of monthly inflow is coming every month. This is excluding the regular flow. So do you envisage a, a situation, maybe not now, but maybe a year from now, where the DI selling could actually, DI buying could actually outnumber the FI number? If you look at the last six months, that has happened. I think I clearly see. I'll uh, right, like to live in a, you know I like to believe it's going to be the other way around both will keep bang because the india's sto- growth story is so attractive find us on facebook at facebook.com/etnow and don't forget to click the like button you can also follow us on twitter at @etnow live to stay updated with all our programming hit the subscribe button on our youtube channel by logging on to youtube.com/user/etnow